see a number of patients who have myalgia parasthetica, which is another name for compression of the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve. That's the nerve on the outside of the thigh that comes from the pelvis to the outer half of the thigh. Patients typically have an intense burning pain. Sometimes they have itching. Sometimes they'll have um, numbness, uh, pins and needles. Uh, sometimes it will be just unpleasant to touch. Classically, if you look at the textbooks, classically um, symptoms are worse when the patient is sitting down because at that time the nerve is literally kinked as it comes out of the pelvis and into the thigh. We can identify this with physical examination. The patient typically has a lot of tenderness directly at the site where that nerve exits from the pelvis into the thigh underneath the inguinal ligament. And you can check for what's called a tunnel sign and you can percuss over that nerve and sometimes you get a true electrical shock down the thigh. And then if that's the case, we can perform a diagnostic nerve block, again using ultrasound guidance, using local anesthetic and essentially, whatever that patient's complaint is, quote, you know, pain in the outside of my thigh, that pain should go away when the nerve block is placed. One is a classic nerve decompression, where the nerve is simply released or um, untethered. And so if that nerve is traveling under a tight band, it's essentially like taking a tight necktie off where you can't breathe, and then you simply open that up. Uh, that's usually done through a relatively small incision on the outside of the thigh, just at the level of the groin, um, at the um, crease in the groin, just inside that bony prominence uh, of the pelvis. But in severe myalgia parasthetica or in known nerve injuries, uh, one potential effective option is simply to remove the nerve. We find the nerve, after blocking the nerve with local anesthetic, the patient says they either like it or they don't. If they like it, they prefer the blissful, and I use that in quotation marks, numbness over the burning pain, then one option is to simply remove the nerve and implant that nerve deep within the pelvis in a place that is protected, that will not be easily traumatized, and will likely prevent what's called a painful stump neuroma. It is a well-tolerated procedure for nearly every patient. Uh, well over 85% of patients do well with that particular procedure, which is based on the length of the time the pain has been present, the degeneration of the nerve over time, uh, the size of the patient, and a host of other um, variables that uh, we discuss in person with the particular patient.